I always wanted to understand how the natural world works. So basically what makes fundamental particles interact with each other. These are all questions of fundamental physics, but I also liked a lot of technology. My name is Leticia Tarruel. I'm leader of the ultra-cold quantum gases group uh, at ICFO. So I think that what is really exciting about my field of research is that we don't just look at these fundamental physics questions from the theoretical point of view, but we really make devices that allow us to answer these questions or at least try to address them. We know a lot about quantum particles in general. We know very well how an electron works or a single photon works. But when we put many quantum particles together and we make them interact, we have new collective phenomena that emerge. This is called quantum many body physics and this is what we study in my group. Now, solving these quantum many-body problems can be super hard. So what we do in my group is actually ask nature itself. So we build very well-controlled quantum systems and we let them find the solution to our quantum many-body problem. And then by just measuring them, we just get the answer to our problem. And this is very interesting on one hand to try to know, for example, why some materials conduct electricity without any loss, but also to engineer some exotic states of matter that people have speculated about, but that no one has seen in reality. So we can really give reality to some abstract concepts in the lab. Also in fundamental physics, I wanted to understand the theory, but I really wanted to do experiment. All the members of my group really share this vision because we can at the same time every day in the morning do some very abstract calculation on quantum mechanics, in the afternoon, actually, assemble a vacuum chamber, build a laser system. We work in teams. We have three experiments in the group, and each experiment, it's actually a full lab, led by three, four people that work together, collaborate on all these topics, such that they can get a broad vision of a science. When I heard about this group, that they want to build a quantum gas microscope, I thought that's a really great idea. Like, having a possibility to image single atoms and manipulate them and do quantum simulations with them. I found that super intriguing and I'm very happy to be a part of this. Here at ICFO we are building, uh, let's say, a new generation of uh, quantum uh, machines uh, with ultra cold atoms, so we call it quantum simulators. And I enjoy being here because it gives me an experience of being like a senior postdoc, so I not only follow some instructions, I have some uh, freedom and independence to take some decisions and uh, to guide younger colleagues, and I enjoy it very much. I did my PhD in Munich, working in the field of ultra-cold atoms, and now for my postdoc, I got the opportunity to come here to ICFO, where I'm working on a experiment of bosonic mixtures, which complements really nicely with what I did in my PhD, where I was working on fermions. So now I can really widen my horizon, and this is really exciting to me. Actually, what we do is we take atoms and we cool them with lasers, and we also trap them with lasers. And that's why it's very good to do this type of research in an institute like ICFO, that is an optics institute where everything is about light, lasers and optics. And there are also very strong theory groups uh, working in this area. And that makes ICFO a very good place to do this physics that is multidisciplinary because it involves experiments, optics, lasers, and fundamental quantum physics and theory in quantum physics. <laughs>